the flying squirrel. That Bob Newhart made millions of Americans laugh with two of the most popular sitcoms of the 1970s and 80s. Whether playing a Chicago psychologist or a Vermont innkeeper, his deadpan humor stole the show. We've got a perfect marriage. Emily, a perfect marriage is where the husband and the wife have the same IQ. <laughs> in real life, he started out as an accountant. Comedy was just a hobby, but he made it big in 1960. Ladies and gentlemen, Bob Newhart. Recordings of his stand-up routine won three Grammy Awards. In 1972, he arrived in primetime, playing Dr. Bob Hartley in The Bob Newhart Show with Suzanne Plachette as his wife, Emily. The hapless doctor and his quirky co-stars kept audiences laughing for six seasons. I can't understand you with your mouth full. <laughs> he returned to television a few years later with a new show called New Heart. Again, he played the straight man surrounded by off-kilter co-stars. Nice cologne, Dick. Very Vermont. Its final episode is considered a TV classic. You won't believe the dream I just had. Mm. In later years, Newhart played small parts for laughs and collected honors for his influential brand of comedy. People come up to me more and more and, and say, um, uh, thank you for all the laughter. And my response is, thank you for laughing. <laughs> laughter wasn't just his career. Newhart said it was also the secret to his long and happy marriage. Omar Villafranca, CBS News.